Hey guys, just a quick review on the Smoke GCT tank. Um, this was sent to me from GearBest.com for review. Um, this tank uses the uh, NI200 um, nickel coils. Um, comes in this nice little box. Just with a spare piece of glass there. And then down underneath, which I've already got out, you know, pull that out, pull that out, and your little manual in there like that. Um, and then it comes with a, just like most most all tanks these days, comes with a piece of extra spare piece of glass and then an extra coil, as well as the one that comes in it too. But, just give you a little look at the coils it comes with. They did put the uh, the stainless steel mesh in there to prevent spit back and a splatter on there. Um, the, the juice holes here, sorry, the juice holes on the on the coil there look a lot like the Atlantis for nice big juice holes um, does appear to be organic cotton in the coil which I think everybody's most everybody's going that that way with or just straight up organic cotton um, there are some companies that are still messing with the silica um, silica with with the with the cotton um, this is not the, it does come with a drip tip. This is not the one it came with. It's just one I put on it. So we'll look at it. It's got a little bit of gold. Gold on it. There's the top. You can see. Some gold gold rings down at the bottom there. Two of them. It says Gimlet Clouds on it. GCT Gimlet Clouds Tank holds uh, four mils, holds four, four mils of juice. Um, it is a 22 millimeter in diameter, um, 77 millimeters from the top to the bottom of the base. Um, standard 510 threading down here. Um, nice, nice smooth threading on that. Oops. Um, the airflow is it's a lot like the like like the Atlantis. It's your biggest, your second biggest, it's a little smaller, and then your smallest. Sorry, smallest, second, third, fourth. I'll show you on the Atlantis how that's pretty similar. Here's the Atlantis. Smallest, a little bigger, a little bigger, and the biggest. So it's kind of similar to that. Um, just a few cosmetic differences, but um, yeah, the um, these only can you can really only use these with the um, with a mod that only uh, has temperature control or is capable of temperature control. Um, I have the the Smoke M80 Plus X Pro M80 Plus um, works. The the M80 is okay. It, you know, it was um, it was Smoke's uh, first attempt, if I understand correctly, at temperature control. So, you know, not always going to get it right on the first time. So, but it's not a big deal learn from our mistakes so just give you a little demonstration put this in temp mode there and run this at 790 790 degrees at 
48.6 watts. Let's just say that. Give it a shot. Really good flavor off this tank. Um, that um, I'm still learning on the temp control, so um, so I really don't have too many bad things to say about it since this is my first go at the, the whole the whole new temp control thing. I know it's not new, but you know it's it's becoming more popular these days. So. Um, so far, it's, it's been a good little tank, um, good flavor on it. Um, coils, the coil in it, you know, I've been using it for a couple weeks now. It hasn't even shown much um, wear or gunking up at all or anything like that yet. So, um, yeah, good, really good flavor off of it. Um, with my experience with it, it's not really a... A cloud chasing tank, you know. It's a. Uh, I think it's catered more for your um, your flavor chasers. Um, really good, really good full body full body flavor off of it. Um, decent vapor production, but just not like you know, nothing like the um, Arctic or um, you know, Arctic or the the new Atlantis two or anything like that. Um, or anything along those lines. Um, I mean, it it is what it is, and in in my opinion, it's it's basically for the for the flavor chasers. But um, I think it's pretty cool looking. Kind of a kind of has a little bit of a futuristic look to it, with the gold on it, and just something different. You know, I like different. I don't like cookie cutter stuff you know it just gets boring after a while I like I like stuff with a little bit of a um, little bit of a uh, style to it so but uh, yeah I think that about does it guys um, again you can get these at gearbest.com um, gearbest has really good deals on a lot of really nice stuff um, really good deals um, great customer service over there um, just, just overall, really nice people. Uh, fast shipping. Um, I think they, I believe they ship out of uh, Singapore. Um, d I guess that depends on where you at, but um, you know, really fast shipping. You know, but um, I think that about does it. I'm trying to think if I missed anything. Um, um, I think I already w over went over this, but it does hold four mils of juice. 22 millimeter device. Um, it it is set set flush on anything I've put on it. Put it on so um, the drip tips is a uh, is the only con I've found so far. Um, the one it came with, which I've misplaced at the moment, I can't find it. Um, but it fits really loose and it's just. It, a, a loose drip tip just just kind of bugs me, um, but um, I'm sure you can, you know, go get a go get an O-ring from a hardware store or something and fix that problem. But um, you know, I've tried other other drip tips I've got to see if it would you know work better. It's nothing. I mean, it you know they work on there like this little Delrin. It'll work on there, but you see that you see that gap in between there, right there. That just that <laughs> that bugs me. I like them to sit flush, but uh, this little blue anodized drip tip looks all right on there, I think. But um, yeah, again, you can get these at GearBest.com. I will put a description in the um, um, I'll put a link in the description. I'm sorry. Um, on this product 
uh, link you to gearbest.com so you can uh, go and check this uh, this product out and um, all the other good stuff they've got there um, but go check them out they're really they have a lot of really nice stuff for good decent prices and um, free shipping on on gearbest.com as well so um, I think that about does it guys um, thanks for watching